Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial and today it's on Rotator. Before we get into the plugin, I should mention I'm going to be very, very busy over the next few weeks or months. So I will be uploading on the Serveminer channel every week at least, but I'm not sure if I'm going to have time to upload to my main channel. So make sure you go and subscribe to Serveminer, I'll leave a link in the description, and then you'll get at least one plugin video every week. So let's go onto the Rotator plugin. You can see it in action in front of me. And what it does, it allows you to rotate signs, banners, heads, and some other things, and give them a nice particle effect, um, change the speed that they rotate, the direction as well, and if they make any sounds. So the sounds can be quite annoying, which is why I've turned off the sounds. I'm gonna briefly turn them back on. Um, you might be able to hear this, this is probably gonna be quite loud. I'll fly over these just to give you an example of what they sound like and then I'm going to turn it off before it gets too annoying. So music and sounds, let's turn that to zero, there we go. So let's go ahead and create our own. As you can see, you can have literally any particle effect you want. So we've got flames here, an explosion here, and some nice, nice little colors here. So let's fly over to this tree and we're gonna pop down a piece of glass and then a blue banner. And what we need to do is force slash the sign. This will put us in the active signer mode and what we can do in here is just left click it. Left clicking will make the block start spinning, right click will stop it, and then shift left clicking will select a particular spinner. Once we're here, we can type a number to change the RPM, so how fast it spins. So one is the fastest, and if you type something like 100, it pretty much won't move. So let's go with two for this one. And now you can type a sound that you want, so anvil underscore break, um, and that will be the sound effect that it plays and then you can type maybe a particle effect so let's go with uh, cloud I think that's one that's very similar to the explosion one um, villager underscore happy is that one no so you can have a look at the long list of different particle effects uh, on the website but let's go with uh, flame again it's the only one I really know which looks pretty awesome and if you type in mode, it will change the direction that it spins. And then if you want to exit out, you can do the sign again, and that will be that. So let's make another one using a sign. We are going to pop that down, actually use glass, pop down the sign, you can write anything on there, it doesn't really matter. And do full slash the sign again, once you're here, left click it. And then we want to do the particle effect note, which looks really awesome. And we're gonna change the speed to one, so it spins around very, very fast. And let's change the direction as well. That looks really awesome. And then we could use maybe ambient, ambient underscore cave. I think that's a, yes, that is a sound effect that we could use. So that is how the plugin works. It's really simple and it's fantastic. You could do so much with this, just jazz up your spawn, uh, make it more interesting. But that is it for the tutorial. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe to Server Miner and you'll see at least one plugin video every week. Uh, but I will try and still upload here occasionally. But that's it for me. Hopefully not forever. But uh, subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.